Yo, what is up? This is Joshua Casper. Welcome to another Max for Live beginner tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to get your webcam to work inside of Mac. Very basic stuff. You're just going to come over to Vizzle. You're going to come into Input, Intake the Grabber, drop it on the track, lock it down, turn it on, boom. That's it. Done. <laughs> just kidding. I'm actually going to show you how to program this inside of Max by using a jitter. First thing we're going to do is set up a window to display the, the webcam. I'm going to type N to get my devices menu and I'm going to type jit.p window. Now the P window is going to be set inside of Max itself. You could go jit.window, which if I did, and then hit enter, it opens up a fly out window. And this is gonna be useful if you're making a patch that you're gonna be using on a second screen, maybe you're gonna be DJing in live and you want your Max patch to be running on a separate screen or something. This is gonna be very useful. But while you're coding, it can actually be kind of a pain in the butt. So what I like to do is use the P window. So I'm gonna go N, JIT dot P window. And as you can see, that just sets up the window right inside of Max, inside of the patch. And I think that's the best way to go. The next thing we're gonna do is ngit.grab, which is going to take the information from the webcam. And then I need to send a couple messages to control the grab feature, which are open and closed. So I'm gonna type M for message and then open. And then I'm gonna type in M for message close. And I'm going to connect both of those to the grab object. Then from that grab object, I'm going to go into the window. Next, I'm going to set up a toggle. So when I activate that, it's going to activate the Q Metro. And I'm going to come out of the toggle into the Q Metro, out of the Q Metro into the jig grab. I'm going to lock it down, hit open, and that's going to activate the webcam. But what I need to do is activate the Q Metro to get the picture. Boom! There you go. That's how you do it. Another cool thing you can do now that you have that set up is come in and save or create a template. And then when you get into a new project and you just want to load it, you can say, new from template webcam p window is what i named mine but that's how you do it i hope you learned something we'll see you next time